Good morning, everybody. Well, happy Easter. Um, <coughs> summer um, hasn't really hit yet. It has been getting nice. Um, trying to get everything uh, hooked up with the truck and the tent and, uh, for our camping season 2019. I am coming up with a lot of different recipes this year. Um, so when I'm out camping, uh, what will work, what won't work. So today, for Easter, I am trying a chicken, a white cheese chicken enchiladas. So, yeah, uh, hopefully it'll turn out pretty good. We'll see. All right, guys, I'll give you the recipe and stuff like that a little bit further on, and I'll take some photos. All right, peace out. Happy Easter. See ya. Everybody, um, I am. It's Easter, and I did a little blip on my video before. I'll pack them all together and stuff, so I'm adding on to it a little bit more. Um, on my um, chicken enchiladas that I'll be making today, uh, what you want to do first is get a couple breasts of uh, chicken breast, and um, <laughs> get some chicken breast. And uh, what I did was I sautéed them in a lot of lemon juice, lime juice, uh, some apple cider, um, some lighthouse from uh, Thunder Bay Winery. Ooh, okay. Um, so what I've got going on, I'll just do a real quick blip here. Um, got them in here, got them cooking. Uh, you're going to want to shred the trick chicken. <coughs> I'm going to put a little uh, flare on mine. Um, I'm adding, normally you would add some uh, green chilies. I'm going to add some uh, green chili and diced tomatoes in with it. You'll take some chicken broth, throw that in there. We're going to take some onions, um, cut them up, and some green bell peppers, some regular red peppers, yellow, orange. Um, got my tortillas. Uh, ready to roll, sour cream, and mozzarella cheese. So, um, yeah, what I'll do is I'll take the chicken, shred it all up, uh, put it in a bowl, mix it up with some sour cream and stuff, um, add some uh, the green chilies and tomatoes in with it, some onions, I'll be cooking those up a little bit just to soften them up a little bit. And then I'll be adding the chicken broth in um, and doing a cream sauce on top of the uh, chicken enchiladas. But I'll, then I'll take the, the meat, roll those onions up with the chicken, uh, a little bit of cheese, uh, a little bit of tomatoes on the inside, roll it up, uh, place them in a, in a uh, little pan here. I'll be cooking them in the um, toaster oven. Um, probably about 375, 400. Um, I, I took a lot of different recipes and I'm kind of combined. I always do this. I'll watch a bunch of different videos, see what people have been doing, and then I'll combine them to my own. But uh, you really want to add like uh, some lemon juice, lime juice in with the chicken. I think it gives it a great flavor. <coughs> um, and also cook with a little bit of apple cider that, that really helps with the flavor of it and stuff. So. Yeah, if I can do this right, I'll do a little blip, blip, blip with videos and kind of combine them all together. So, all right, peace out. Okay, last <laughs> last video. Um, I hope this comes through on the speaker. So I was listening to some tunes while I was cooking. Okay, so what I did was um, to add on to all the videos that I did. Um, I think there's only like two or three. I uh, cooked up my chicken, uh, got her all ready to go, um, shredded it up, chicken breast, 
uh, added um, green chilies, a little bit of tomatoes, onions, peppers, um, rolled them up in a tortilla, and uh, placed them in a cooking pan. Um, I did do a cream sauce with sour cream, cheese, uh, green enchiladas, a little bit of butter, flour, just to coagulate it up. Oy, oy, oy. And uh, so I uh, rolled up the tortillas, threw them in the pan, poured the uh, cheese sauce on top, put a little bit of extra onions on it, uh, covered it with mozzarella cheese and some parsley flakes. So I'm gonna spin it around here and show you. Hope that comes out. That's my first pan. I got lots of uh, chicken enchiladas for later. And I also have a lot of cheese sauce for later. So I'm gonna see how this pan turns out and then I will probably do another pan. Cool, all right guys, peace out and have a happy Easter day and uh, I hope you have a great summer. See ya. Well, last video. This is just to finalize it up. Um, you know, I've done chicken enchiladas down the river, down the Grand Canyon for so many years. And then on Lake Powell, like camping, I always did it Dutch oven style. You know, you lay the tortillas down, you put all your mixings in there, you just layer it and stuff like that, put the cheese on top, and you put the coals on the top and the bottom and you just let it bake. Um, it's a great way to do it. Um, if you've got access to coals and Dutch oven and stuff like that. So I wanted to try this recipe to see how it would work and then I'm going to incorporate it into my camping gear that I have. So I'm going to spin it around. Looks like it turned out pretty well. So, And I hope that is showing. There we go. Close up. So, cool. I'm excited. Um, I have enough um, mixture to make it out of a uh, corn tortilla. This one I did in a flour tortilla. Um, it made one, two, three, four, five uh, rolled burrito size. Cut those in half, you got eight. So yeah, I'm excited to try it. You guys have a great summer. Peace out, this is Cooking, cooking with Russ, I guess. Ah, camping with Russ. <laughs> See you guys.